Hey everyone, we are making some dehydrated fruits and vegetables today. Baby Rogue is gonna supervise. She's a really good supervisor. I have never tried to dehydrate whole green beans, so I'm going, or, <laughs> I've never tried to dehydrate frozen vegetables. So this is an experiment. I've heard it works. And specifically the person I was talking about it said that the green beans, frozen green beans worked. Um, and then I'm going to do apples with some cinnamon and then some carrots. I got the green beans on there. I tried to get the whole bag with the friggin' won't work, I don't think. I can try to stuff a few more on there. Alright, carrots are done. She's mad because I took the phone away from her. She was watching her tunes. Sorry, babe, hold on. Okay, so carrots are done. I'm sure I cut them a little too thick. Um, but, uh, you know, this is experimentation. Of course, you know, there's smaller ones. These are going to be done first before the bigger ones and all that stuff. But this is all experimentation. I've never done carrots, never done green beans. I have done apples. Okay, baby, hold on. Sheesh. What, do you want this? Do you want this? Want the phone? The phone? Oh, in the mouth. These are huge apple slices. This is from one apple. And I ha that's, that's still from the same apple. I haven't even finished it. I cut that one up to eat myself. But, uh, yeah, I went out to do, I didn't think I was gonna use this last tray, but I totally am. Crazy. Uh. So step one, survival, uh, put, uh, did some dehydrating and he did cinnamon on his apples. I've never actually dehydrated apples with cinnamon, but I decided to do just, um, one, um, one with the cinnamon and one without. I love cinnamon though. Cinnamon, I try to put in everything like cookies, my shakes, all that kind of thing. Cause cinnamon is so good for you in so many ways. So, um, anyway, so we're going to go ahead and get this going. Another part of this experiment is um, rehydrating the uh, vegetables down here and see about rehydrating them, see how that works. So um, yeah, these all have different times and stuff. So I will pull the racks out when they're done, you know, each individual rack. Um, but uh, we're gonna check it, you know, in a few hours and then a few hours after that, a few hours after that, it's about one o'clock. So um, hopefully won't have to go um, until one, but we'll see, some of them do. Like carrots, I think, may have to be pretty long, but we'll see. Hey, so it's been about five hours. I started at one o'clock-ish, it's almost six. They look good. They look really, really good. See how the carrots look? Carrots might take a little bit longer, but the beans are pretty much, look, the carrots are falling through. Uh, the beans are pretty much done almost, and then the um, the apples are pretty much almost done too. Just gonna give them a, maybe another hour or so. But the beans, I don't know, those really look done to me. I just took another look. They're not done. They're not done. No. <laughs> Definitely still moist. Still need a little more time. But yeah, a couple more hours, two, three more hours for some of them. So you're getting close. Okay, so the carrots and the green beans are done. I mean, these are done, 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 done. Yeah. They are done. And uh, so the whole point of these is what I would do is if I were to take these anywhere, camping, whatever, these I would rehydrate to like mix with whatever I have with me. So mixing it with, you know, um, rice or mixing it with beans or mixing it with whatever, you know, as a side dish, something like that. And, um, so yeah, that's what I would do. So, oh, by the way, these both took seven hours. Uh, the carrots took seven, the green beans took seven hours. Uh, yeah. All right. The apples are done. Um, the taste test, we've already tasted it. It's so good. I used Fuji apples and with a little bit of cinnamon. Mmm. It's so good. But, uh, yeah, it took, um, mm -hmm, about eight hours to fully do the apples. And they were pretty thick slices. Well, they weren't thick, they were big. But, uh, these won't last very long <laughs> at all. I love apple. Um, okay, so now we're going to do the taste, the test of, um, actually the next video will do, be a test of actually rehydrating the, um, vegetables, so stay tuned for that, and I'll see you later, bye.